Hey, this is Dave at HouseBearings.com. Today we're going to show you how to move a lot of dirt in a fast and easy way uh, without breaking your back. If you're new to our channel, consider subscribing. We're going to show you how to do a job yourself so you can save a ton of money. Our problem here is the lay of this land, this house sits higher than this house. And all that land back there is higher than both houses. And so when it rains, all this water comes rushing through here. So this whole area, you can see we started, we're gonna fill this whole area with dirt to uh, correct the flow of water towards the street. So what we got is seven yards of brown pulverized topsoil, which is good for planting grass. And so what we're doing is we have to move that. And we have two methods of doing it. We could use a wheelbarrow, but it takes a good strong back to do that. <laughs> That's why he's here. The amount of dirt that you get in, say that, you know, just regular worker wheelbarrow is about half of what you're gonna be able to get in this. This gets you six or seven uh, cubic feet. And, uh, oh yeah, I'll show you what it is. This is the Gorilla Carts. And it's a winner. It's got your pneumatic, your pneumatic tires. Uh, handle. I'll show you the real whiz bang in just a second. First, we'll fill it up. All right. So let's go take this. And this is way easier. Uh, you know, I'm not straining much. It's more just pulling and walking. And so it takes a lot off the, the stress of your back. So now, the, the beauty of this is in how they designed it. It has this yellow handle, and you pull up on this handle, and it releases the latch, and then you lift. Now this is, uh, admittedly, this is one time you have to lift, but it pivots nicely, and there you go. And if you notice how the rear wheels come up over the frame, so you really get a, a full dump on everything, there you go. One, two, three. Pretty easy. Very little lifting in the grand scheme of things compared to this young man who has to literally carry half the weight of the dirt with every trip. All I have to do is pull it. This bed is plastic, handles plastic, admittedly, that could be uh, in the long run could be a, a failure point, but the reality is I've used this, my daughter's used this to move yards and yards of dirt. We've, I moved six yards the other day. We're doing another seven today. It doesn't show any signs of wear. So uh, I think for the long run, it's gonna be a good value. I think they're around, oh, I have to look. Uh, I think they're $100. The value for your money and the, the, what you save as far as the stress on your back, can't, I can't say enough good things about it. This is my daughter's, but I'm probably going to end up getting one just for myself, just because it's too handy, uh, too handy to be able to pull things as opposed to carry it. Right, another thing that's really nice about this cart is it's fairly light. They got two fingers under it there. This is really a nice thing. It adds to the value, just not having to have the, you know, some wheelbarrows can be very heavy, but not this guy. With just one wheelbarrow, I was able to move six yards of dirt in about five hours and I went quite a long distance with much of the dirt. If you got any questions, leave them in the comment section below. If you got anything out of this, give us a thumbs up. We really appreciate it. Thanks for viewing and don't forget, subscribe. We got lots of videos coming.